Let's do it. So today, what we, if you remember, we've got your little trauma work, the timeline, the story, and, and just for ritual, because ritual is a part of growth, we're going to actually burn this real quick before we start. And the, and the reason why we're going to burn it is not to suggest that somehow this part of you is dead, but that this part of you is behind you. Does that make sense? We're always going to have our life story. We don't want to burn our past. We don't want to burn our childhood. We just want to somehow ritualize that that, that now is as ashes, and from that ashes is going to come new life. Kind of like the phoenix. Okay? So it's it's another it's just another form of of, of spiritual and mental kind of development, okay? So are we ready to okay. light it? Okay, I'll light. Um, and can can you can you stand and do the burning? And remember what you're doing. The natural progression for me being going from fear to actually going to success. From ashes to renewal. To renewal, to the phoenix, out of ashes we rise. We're burning that. And there's a lot of there's a lot of fear in those on those papers, if you recall, huh? A lot of fear, a lot of awkwardness, as she was saying, a lot of sadness. And I I'm think, impressed. and and I I just want to uh, again remind you, we we want excitement, but we also want a calmness, because this is going to be um, this is going to be stretching out of the comfort zone, right. okay? Mm -hmm. So what I'm thinking we'll do is you. We'll get in the water with her. I didn't come prepared for this. Sure, sure. Uh, so how's it feel so far? Mm -hmm. Good. Mm -hmm. So good. So good. Thank you. And just stand. Yeah. And if you want to, Whitney, walk around. <laughs> How are you feeling, Elizabeth? I'm feeling good. Baby. Good. Enjoy that water. This is comfort zone. Okay, this is comfort zone. I would like, if at all possible, for you to see both of us, because the way I would like for you to do this is I would like for you to imagine yourself. What you're going to do is you're going to go under, but you're not gonna stay long, okay? You're gonna just, and you're just gonna go down and up, and you're gonna do it at your comfort level. So if you need to stay up for a couple of seconds, all right, we ready? And just go under and then come back up with no panic. You're not a fearful. This is fine. You're comfortable. Ready? Go. That's all right. That's all right. That's good. That's good. Good start. Good start. That's good start. What I'd like for you to do is try not to go forward. Try to go straight down if possible to take the entire head under instead of just a little because that's where you get scared with the nose and the mouth. So go as far under as you can, okay? Push yourself a little. I can do this. Beautiful. 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 Do it again. No, we, what we want to do it as many times, and when you can start staying under longer, do it. We don't want to stop each time. You just do. You just do your thing. Whitney's with you. You did it. You did it. You were under for probably three to four seconds. Oh, no. But maybe longer. But but what was great is you looked comfortable. Elizabeth, did you feel it? Yeah. You looked like you were comfortable. It's just water. It's just water. And imagine and imagine all of God's creatures that you're gonna see one of these days when you go to Hawaii. All the way. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, 
11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 